I'm not going to wear the clothing. I'm just going to go in. We are fighting Nicholas Donnelly's team. All right. Also, I'm in the VC right now. So uh, if anyone joins, then someone joins. Let's see. Citrus Berry, Terra Fire with Dazzling Gleam. Rocky Helmet, Terra Steel. So I can fake it out. And it does a taunt, which is always a problem. Single Strike Arshifu. Ogre Pond. Iron Hands. Blood Moon Ursaluna. Okay, time to beat this team. If we can beat this team, I think Raging Bolt looks pretty strong here. And Fluttermane's actually really strong. Let's see. Do I I think leading Fluttermane Raging Bolt's actually really cool. I haven't used this specific lead before. And then Amoongus in the back. And the last one. Ogre Pond. I will go Ogre Pond first. Also, my nicknames aren't here. My poor nicknames. Uh, is this thing capable of being in Tailwind? I don't know how much speed Nicholas ran on it. I guess I'll just Terra Fairy Moonblast. Because it does one-shot Ur Ursaluna. I, want, I was going to Gleam, but then I realized, hey, I think this is overall probably much better. I think. I need my nicknames, though. What the hell? Oh my god, it is faster. Oh my god, it's faster. Okay, well, it's not faster anymore, but that's a lot of speed. That is a lot of speed on the Earth of Luna. That's crazy. Alright, we, we we for sure spiky shield here. Actually, do we? I think we do. And then we Electro Web again. Spiky. He protects. Bleak win. Okay, I think this is fine. Web. And should I try threatening a Thunderclap? Probably not. Ah, shit. I, I can Ogre Pawn it. And then go for Dragon Pulse. Probably not my best. Yeah, that, that was a bad start. I did not realize that the Ursa Luna would outspeed. Oh, God. Uh, I wish I just doubled into you. <laughs> so many mods are dead. Okay, well, this is dumb. What else do you have? Urshifu's fine. Ogre Pond would be horrible. So don't be Ogre Pond. Please. Don't be Ogre Pond. Be... Iron Hands is annoying. Urshifu. Okay, so I'm gonna... S actually... Sludge Bomb it. I think I sludge bomb it. Okay, protect, bleak wind. No, it taunts. Okay. Could have pollen puff there, but doesn't. Wh whatever. So we're down 2v2. It's Urshifu and what? Raging Bolt and Amoongus is still pretty strong here. It's Ogre Pond. That's awful. That's terrible. That's so bad. <laughs> Ivy Cudgel. Amoongus survives, which is really good. Wicked Blow does a lot. We KO Urshifu. And now we need to somehow KO this Ogre Pond. I think... How bulky is it? I'm not that strong on my Raging Bolt. I mean, I'm modest. I'm modest 180. That's actually really strong. But I don't think it's strong enough. I think Pollen Puff is actually better. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I don't die. The value of Sludge Bomb. I really like Sludge Bomb. Okay. So last time it was Tornadus Urshifu. No, it was Tornadus Ursaluna. Um, I think I just go Fluttermane. <laughs> Do I want to bring Fluttermane as the lead? If I bring King Gambit, that'll be interesting, but it's not good against the rest of the team. I guess for Rigorath. Ogre Pond is probably fine. Amoongus is probably not fine. Raging Bolt is probably fine as well. And then I can bring Fluttermane and... Based on the previous leads, I think Gouging Fire is better. I do really like the idea of Amoongus, though. You know, maybe we... That might have been an Ivy Cudgel roll. Alright, Ivy Cudgel, Electro Web. Maybe this is a misplay, we'll see. Who knows, they might start protecting. But I can, I can Spiky Shield if they protect Earth Luna this turn. Who knows, I might be misplaying. Turn 1 Terra. And it's not that much of an offensive Terra. I want that special defense boost. Let's see, is it Terra Normal? I think it's Terra Normal. Alright. 
Okay, Hyper Force or Blood Moon? Blood Moon, does that kill? No, Raging Bolt's too bulky. So it should die? It's gonna be close. I threatened Thunderclap, but... Mm, I guess I'll go for the Thunderclap. Because why not? Why not? Because it's predictable. But do I want to hard read it? Probably not. Did I get it? I got it. Nice. I think that was a sack, but still. Who? Alright. Not, not, Urshifu is really threatening right now against my two mons. Ogre Pond is Woodhammer, right? Hmm. It's gonna go for Woodhammer. I'm gonna Ivy Cudger the Ogre Pond. And Thunderclap the Tornadus. This might be really stupid. No, no, no. I dry. Ivy Cudgel, Dragon Pulse. Urshifu comes in. And Ivy, I, 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 got, I got the call right. I was calling that it would target my uh, freaking Raging Bolt. Because the spiky shield is so obvious. But now I can't really pretend because it's a bloody Urshifu. Hmm. Should I spiky shield anyways? I think so. And then I'll go for Heat Crash into Urshifu. I think that's definitely oh. my play. When did someone join? I'm recording a video. Oh. Should I leave the VC? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I win. I think. I'm pretty sure I win. I win. I die. That oh that actually dies. I don't ever live. Well, I won. Um. Yeah, I think we should leave. I have officially left, and we are four points away from fifteen hundred. I have been stuck at fourteen hundred for mo multiple weeks already, and it's stupid. Also, I just had screw nicknames. Uh, 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 Size spam. All right. Booster Energy, Terra Water Blast, Follow Me, Rocky Helmet, Sash, Specs Perish Song, Icy Wind, No Taunt, meaning Amoongus can probably come. I don't... No, 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 Amoongus King Gamp. Amoongus King Gamp is the perfect lead, and Raging Bolt and someone else in the back is nice. The thing is, who do I bring in the back? Ogre Pond for the Follow Me? But is Follow Me even worth it? It's probably... I think Ogre Pond's the best. Or is, is Gouging Fire better? Gouging Fire is significantly bulkier. But Ogre Pond has the Terra option. I think we go Ogre Pond. That might be a misplay. Who knows? I don't know. I don't know. And this is the perfect lead. This is the perfect lead. We Rage Powder and we Sword Dance. Because now we break its Focus size. I go into Flutter Main. And a Flutter Main can tear a Fairy, and I am pretty damn sure it survives a Wicked Blow. It's been a while since I looked at the EV spread. Ugh. I'm pretty sure it survived Wicked Blow. Terra Dark Wicked Blow. Got freaking size Spam. I hate size Spam. Another thing I can do is... Oh, wait. Oh, this is still Terra Dark. Recently, I changed it to Terra Fairy, but this is the PC. So it's actually Terra Dark. All right, let's make some changes. I think Terra Fairy. Also, I don't. I should I change the EV spray? Ah, I like the EV spray. Uh, Rage Powder, Wicked Blow, and we Urshifu is faster than Tornadoes, which I think we should be expecting. Give me, give me the speed drop. Let's go. I should have just attacked immediately, but whatever. We're plus three. Did not bring Flutter Main. I realize. I'm gonna go into Raging Bolt, and I'm just gonna go for. Hmm. I should have gone Ogre Pond. I'm an idiot. Should I switch or King Gambit out? Okay. I think I switch King Gambit out. Or should I just let it take the hit? Screw. I'm gonna sucker punch the Urshifu. I'm gonna sucker punch the Urshifu. I'm not gonna sucker punch. And also now we're very vulnerable to Iron Crown. Very vulnerable. Because Ogre Pond doesn't have the boost. And it's probably and it's almost certainly special attack boosting. But we do have Snarl. 
which is very good into this. It is special attack boosting, like I like I expected. I think we lose round game one. God, I hate Psy spam. How high is this? That's it. I mean, it's not that bad, I guess. Dude, it just goes for expanding force and psychic. Right? Oh, it has helping hand. <laughs> it goes for expanding force. Helping hand. Terra water. Hmm. Terra water is interesting. Okay, so if it's Terra water... There's no way Ogre Punch can win this, but... I can try. Helping hand. Expanding force. Jesus Christ! Okay, I killed that. And if Tornadoes can just miss a bunch of Bleak Wind Storms, then we can maybe win. I'm not gonna spiky shield, I'm just gonna Ivy Cut Jill. But if it lands one Bleak Wind, we're dead. <laughs> one Bleak Wind Storm. Unless we somehow Horn Leech the Fool, which we're, we're not going. Okay. Okay, well, I didn't play at my best that battle. But this time, if we just go into the freaking Ogre Pond, then we're good. So, like, Ogre Pond was good for the follow me. I just didn't bring the follow me. Same, same, same Mons. We go same Mons. I don't think Fluttermane should come. I don't think. I guess I could lead with it, and it wouldn't be the worst thing. Like, I could go Fluttermane and Moongus. Actually, that's not a horrible idea. No, I should have brought Fluttermane. No, uh... Okay, okay. I'm gonna read the Urshifu... Protecting... Is it realistic that it protects here? Will the Urshifu protect? Is there any reason for it to? If it goes for Wicked Blow into Amoongus... Yeah, I think I click. I think I think we go for Spore Kowtow. Okay, I I I meant Spore into Tornadoes. I'm an idiot. Okay, we get the boost, which is nice, and we know that the Urshifu is faster, so I can go for this. I can go for Rage Powder plus Kowtow into Torn, and I do want the Torn dead. We really want Torn dead, and he can't really switch out either. Okay, this is a way better position than last time. Because I count out cleaved instead. Terra Dark. Yeah, actually, actually now that I think about it, he probably did need that. Oh, wait. Oh, he doesn't... Okay, Ogre Pond this time. <laughs> Ogre Pond this time. Should have brought Fluttermane. I, re I really wish I brought Fluttermane, but whatever. Ivy Cudgel and... Kowtow, obviously... Ivy Cudgel, Tau Tau Cleave is gonna close combat into King Gambit. I lived that. I have never lived that before. That's, huh? Wait, what is this EV spread? I changed it on the phone as well for this one. It's supposed to be bulkier than this. It's supposed to be bulkier. Damn. The last one definitely definitely Iron Crown and I realize we have some issues. Spiky Shield Whatever. I I actually now that I think about it, maybe we do lose. Oh that's real oh that's unfortunate. I can account that to do uh Let's Terra Fairy, let's Dragon Pulse you Eh, whatever. Okay, we get it, but it doesn't matter. I assume a CC is coming out. There's a CC. Urshifu's dead, but I know I lose to the Iron Crown. I hate Psy Spam! <laughs> and I don't think it would have been too different if I brought Flutterman because there was Tailwind. So Flutterman was slower. Pretty much always slower. That was such a bad loss. I think I fought this team before. 
and I definitely lost that time. I don't know what to expect. Swagger Tornadoes. Jesus. Oh, it's Swagger Own Tempo. Oh my god, it's Swagger Own Tempo. Uh, <laughs> and it's Taunt Tornado, so Amoongus is out of the question. <laughs> oh no. I remember the Tinkaton was stupidly good against me. Gouging fire, that doesn't make sense. Gouging, Ogre, Flutter, King? Moongus? Probably Moongus. Urshifu Tinkaton, the lead I expected, and not the one I wanted to see. <laughs> so he gets one fake out, then one... Yeah, I, I'm going after you first. Stellar Terra. Which one is he going after? He crashed. It's down. I hate that thing. I think it's Ogre Pond. Uh oh Close combat. Hmm. Don't be torn. Don't be torn. I was. I. I. I should have expected that. <laughs> I mean, the torn was technically pretty obvious. Let's go for heat crashing to you. Does no rage powder goes before taunt. Right. 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 It's plus two priority. So he rage powder away the taunt because. Uh, then Urshifu will still attack into Moongus. And now we click Breaking Swipe. And Sludge Bomb. Okay, I don't like that at all. Terra Fairy, do I live? Probably not. Breaking Swipe and... Hmm. Let's see, he's used Wicked Blow, he's used... Do I die to Wicked Blow? No way. No, no, no way do I die to Wicked Blow. I'm I'm doing this. I'm making this play. If things go how I expect them to, no, wait, wait, no, 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 no. Okay, wait, yeah, yeah, wait, 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 yeah, 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 yeah. We do win. Wait, no, we don't. No, we don't. No, we don't. <laughs> no, I still lose. How fast is their raging bull? Because thunderbolt. Wow, it's faster than my flutter main. Oh wow, I do no damage. Burning bulwark. I think I lost again. Why am I trash? Okay, so now we know that Raging Bolt is very fast. Not very, but quite fast. Yeah, it's actually only a little bit of speed. Okay. Gouging Fire. Is Flutter Mane a worthwhile lead? Yeah, it is. Yeah, 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 it is. Flutter Mane Gouging Fire actually does a lot. I should have done that. And then Ogre Pawn and the Moongus. But I really want to bring Raging Bolt. They didn't bring Crest Luna last time. Flutter, Gouging, Raging. Maybe Ogre Pond. Maybe leaving Ogre Pond's a mistake. I don't know. Heat Crash. Dazzling Gleam. Heat Crash. I'm not going to burn in Bulwark from the fake out. If that's a mistake, then it's a mistake. And I probably should Terra Fairy, actually. I, I swear Terra Fairy comes to bite me later. Like, I need Terra Fairy on Raging Bolt, or I need Terra Water on Amoongus. I don't think I need Terra Grass on Gouging Fire. It does go for the Fake Out, risking the Burning Bulwark. And now Tailwind's coming out, so I'm gonna switch. I just want to get rid of the Tinkaton, so that Fluttermane can actually do stuff. Switches out. Okay, Heat Crashes. I should've Heat Crashed the Tornadoes, like I was actually kind of thinking about. Hmm... <laughs> Sludge Bomb you, Burning Ball Work. Is that too predictable? No? Okay, maybe. Depulse? Sludge Bomb? I don't think you Depulse again. I'm gonna predict that he's not gonna Depulse. I'm predicting him to predict Fluttermane. He did not predict Fluttermane. Dude, I can't switch to Fluttermane. Why did you do that? Whatever. Go into Raging Bolt. Sludge Bomb. No, I think I just Pollen Puff, and then... Do I Depulse? I think I Electro Web. Yeah, I definitely I definitely Electro Web. I really liked Electro Web. I was thinking, is this worth it? Over Volt Switch or Thunderbolt? But my god, Electro Web's been pretty fun. Just as a spread move, really. We have a chance of winning this. This is such a tough battle. This team is so stupid. I don't know if I, I... I think it last time I was 0-2 against this team. 
Or at least it was a similar team. It was a Tinkaton or a Luna team, I remember. But is it this exact version? I don't know. I mean, this person's got a cool avatar. 1555, jeez. Wrong, wrong dodge. Dragon Poles, big damage. Electro Web. Going to Flutter. I can get faked out now, but I can also just die. No. Please fake out. No, they made the right play. Dude, that team is so... Ugh. Okay, Sun. I have not lost the battle to Sun yet. Is this going to be the first one? I'm not stopping until I just win one more freaking battle. Okay. Um, I don't know what they lead with. I'm going to go Amoongus lead. I think Amoongus lead is incredible. How do I match the Ogre? Gouging Fire... And then Flutter Main. Or should I go Ogre Pond? It doesn't make any sense, does it? Raging Bolt does make sense. Does Amoongus Raging Bolt make sense, though? Amoongus Raging Bolt. Psh. I have three Protosynthesis Pokemon. Come on, I have three Protosynthesisers. <laughs> I started to lead, like, Rillaboom and Cineroar. Or, like, Flutter Main. Incineroar. This is the first Incineroar I've had to fight. I don't think they're gonna bring it though. People almost never bring Incineroar against me. When they do bring it, it's quite a problem, but because I have King Gambit, which I could very well lead into this battle if I so desired. I don't know. Every, every single member on my team can come. Everyone can come. I think Ogre Pond and King Gambit are the weakest links though. I think. Alright, just basic lead. Sludge Bomb. I Hmm. Terra Water Sludge Bomb. Does it have Taunt? It has Encore. Do I want to deal with that? I think I just Sludge Bomb Depulse. And then we look incredible. Right? Sludge Bomb Depulse. Also, it's Terra Grass. What? T Terra Grass? Why? <laughs> Protect. Sunny day, Sludge Bomb, get the kill. Now we're at Terra Water. So if Ogre Pond decides to come out, I'm going to have to start thinking about what to do from there. But I do have a nice switch in and gouging. It's just whether... Do I, I don't think I eat a Draco Meteor. Oh, Rillaboom. Eh, same thing. Um, I could just Thunderclap the Walking Wake. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, Raining Bull's going to go down here, but whatever. Or I could have just Rage Powdered. That also works. I could have just Rage Powder. Let's see. Meteor. Rage Bolt goes down. Fake. Wood Hammer comes out. And now I bring this in. And now we win. <laughs> right? <laughs> right? Come on. Please. 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 I just want a victory. I've had two horrible losses after coming so close. The closest I've ever been to 1500 with this team. With this team. I've been 1600 before in 2022. And I think Regulation C. Maybe. With my Cerulite Sandy Shocks team, and Glimora, and Meowscarada, and also Ting Luth Letter Bay. That was such a cool team. Taking time to think because this is a tough position for you. Uh, feel free. Wait, he's gonna Terra Fire. I'm an idiot. I forgot about Terra Fire. How did I forget Terra Fire? Okay, well, I can Heat Crash you. The Flutter, switch into Amoongus on the Grassy Glide. Amoongus is going to take a fat chunk. Amoongus is going to take a f chunk. I could Breaking Swipe, but it doesn't do anything. I'd rather just claim the kill on Flutter. Which, they can't really play around very easily. And I don't think they want to switch into Walking Away because I can very, very easily Breaking Swipe here. Damn it! Am I going to lose the Sun? No, 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 no. No, no, no. Breaking Swipe. Wait, does Breaking Swipe even kill? Dude. Breaking Swipe doesn't kill Walking Wake. Wait. Oh, oh, oh. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, was that a choke? Was that a choke? Maybe, maybe, maybe? Breaking Swipe? No, it wasn't the choke. Never mind. It was not a choke. I think I somehow lose. 
Which is... Wait, do I die to Grassy Glide? If I die to Grassy Glide, then yeah, I'm screwed. Maybe I should have Breaking Swipe, huh? Huh? Oh, no. Come on, I can't win this. Gouging Fire is so good into this team. They left behind Ogre Pond and Incineroar. Come on. I forgot. If I just remember the... Did it miss Draco Meteor? Oh, it died! Oh! Oh, it died. Oh, I win. Okay, good. Okay, thank God. That would have been so embarrassing because of my matchup is so good. Okay, again. Come on, please. Please. Same lead. Raiding Bolt Amoongas. Raiding Bolt Amoongas. Gouging Flutter. They're going to prep for that. With, like, Incineroar and Fluttermay, like I said earlier. Or maybe they'll bring Ogre Pond. Grassy Glide Ogre Pond is a legitimate concern. I can lead Gouging Fire and then have, like, Fluttermane in the back. But that could be bad, depending on how the battle goes. I think genuinely Amoongus... Fluttermane... Raging Bolt and Gouging Fire... Maybe I should bring Ogre Pond Wellspring, because I'm kind of... That's so bad against Incino against Rillaboom, but, like, if it Terra's, then... It, they're pretty good. And then Ogre Pond is great against the whole team, besides Whimsicott, which is... It's Whimsicott. Last time, Whimsicott didn't really do anything, so maybe they won't bring it this time, and they'll go Incineroar. Which is scary. But then Incineroar what? Incineroar Rillaboom? Incineroar Wake? Incineroar Flutter? I don't know. Should I bring King Gambit? Expecting that? Screw it. Sure. But King Gambit what? King Gambit Flutter? King Gambit Gouging? I think I go Gouging, King Gambit, Flutter, Raging. It is Flutter. It is It is Incineroar, Flutter main. I, I am the GOAT. <laughs> what does it go for? I'm going to click Howl and Sucker Punch. I can just double protect as well. Double protect is extremely safe. If they make a good play and switch to Rillaboom, good play on their part. But then at least that means the fake out's more likely into gouging. And if it's into gouging, if the fake out from Rillaboom is into gouging fire. Actually, Incineroar can just parting shot. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Incineroar can parting shot here. Incineroar can parting shot. I hate that. <laughs> I don't want to sucker punch the Flutter Man. I'll protect King Gambit. Whimsicott comes out. Oh, it's not Rillaboom. It's Whimsicott. They still brought the Whimsicott. Did they parting shot? They parting shot it. Okay, nice. Not the best play. I'm not saying parting shot is great, but hey, at least I read it. Which is cool. Flutter Man is back in. Is it going to go for a Sun? I can sucker punch you. And then he crashed the Whimsicott. Oh, wait, they just go for freaking Encore into one of my guys. It just Encores. Who does it Encore? Gouging or King? I think King, because King's at plus two. Maybe King was a mistake. King Gambit might have been a mistake. And then Gouging Fire, Howl. I don't think you lock me into Howl. I think I go for Heat Crash into the... Is it better to go for it into Flutter Mane? How annoying is this Whimsicott? I think I'll go into Flutter Mane first. Dude, it's gonna get such a big spec dazzling beam off. Alright, this battle I definitely didn't play my best. I'm playing really poorly today, wow. Flutter? I did not want to see that! Oh, that's a one shot. Alright, unfortunate. Wait, it didn't even go for Encore! What? It didn't even Encore. What was the point? God, I need to make such an aggressive prediction. Let me think. I need to get King Gambit and Raging Bolt side by side. But how do I do that? I go into King... Maybe I don't have to. Maybe. Maybe this is the play. I wasn't going to do this at first, but now I am. I can also just double the Flutter. 
But then maybe it doesn't want to eat Sucker. Maybe they switch to Incineroar despite King Gambit. Maybe. I really want to switch Gouging Fire out. I really, really want to switch Gouging Fire out. But I... Rillaboom comes in. I could have count out there. I Heat Crash the Whimsicott. It does no damage. Heat Crash. That's a good That's a good Heat Crash. Now I can just Burning Bulwark Protect. No, I can't protect in front of Whimsicott. I'm an idiot. No, no, we can't protect in front of Whimsicott ever. Tow Tow into the Rillaboom. Because the Rillaboom, I need to get rid of it. Whimsicott. I can't really just ignore Whimsicott, but I don't think I even KO, so what's the point? It does... Okay, neither can touch King Gambit, but I can't Source Dance either. Because Whimsicott is on the field. And it can Encore me into Sucker Punch. But I'm fine if it does that for now. For now, I'm okay with that. I just need to go for this Tao Tao Cleave. Fake out into King. Whimsicott's going for Moonblast into the super effective Raging Bolt and lowering my special attack. Ugh. <laughs> King Gambit's back to full, but Raging Bolt's taking damage. And every bit of HP matters on something like Raging Bolt. It's, a, it's my Assault Vest Mon. It matters. I think it makes sense that they left their sun mode behind. It makes a lot of sense. They're not bringing Ogre Pond at all. Gaji Fire must be scary. For wood Hammer. Decent damage. But this Kowtow is going to hurt. That's a big Kowtow. Okay, big Kowtow. And now, we Heat Crash and Kowtow. Or, I, no, no. Heat Crash? Do you switch to Incineroar? No, if you switch to Incineroar, I'm fine. I'm fine if you do that. Hmm. If Whimsicott goes for Moonblast into Gouging... Gouging can never die this turn. Fluttermane, I don't think, is ever a switch in. If Fluttermane switches in, it's taking big damage because I'm hitting both slots. Incinero the, only the best thing they can do is, I guess, switch Incineroar in in the Whimsicott slot, but I don't think that's worth it. Incineroar on that slot. Okay, King Gambit gets a booze, Whimsicott, Moonblast, I never die, special attack drop again, Whimsicott's dead, oh, I forgot I have Rocky Helmet, Kowtow, some damage on In Insin, and I can, hmm, do I go for the Protects? I think I protect King, I don't know about Gouging, I think I protect, I think I do this. Alright, right, right, that, right, that's exactly what I was expecting. Now I go for breaking, no, no, what the hell, what did I just say? Howl, maybe? Yeah, that's Howl. Let's go, no, let's breaking swipe the Incineroar. And should I predict, no, I'm gonna sucker punch. Alright, they did predict, alright, unfortunate, unfortunate. Let's see, Flare Blitz, 46.7%, not fun. I'm gonna go for Breaking Swipe and Protecting Gambit. It, it, no, Breaking Swipe's not even worth it. Heat Crash and Protect. Heat Crash, I don't know if it kills. They're starting to get back into position, which I don't like. Fake out the King. They did Parting Shot. Alright, I gave it a Rillaboom. Oh, they could knock up into Gouging. That does nothing. And I always kill Flutter with Sucker. Okay, we've, we've won. I think we win this battle. It was a tough battle, but I think we absolutely win. And now we Terra Fairy. I've changed the Terra on King. This kills, right? Good. <laughs> I just realized, what if it doesn't kill? All right, King Gambit was worth it. King Gambit was very worth it. Predicted the Incineroar bring, and it paid off. Nice. Ogre Prime Wellspring would have been okay as well. Well, unfortunately, my AL is taking a bit of a hit this video.